Hi, this is Greg DIY RV and Home Camper's Life. Today I'm doing a little repair to my compartment door here on our trailer. And I've noticed for quite some time that uh, the center right here at the bottom of the door is bowed out. Um, and what it is is right here where the trim pieces meet, uh, it's allowing the door to flex. There's no rigidity there and it does get worse when it uh, gets warm out. So my solution is I'm going to take and put a brace right underneath here. Uh, there is enough room. I've already checked that. There's a good 3 sixteenths of an inch underneath there to put a uh, basically a gusset across this. And um, I'm going to do it in aluminum. And what I did is I uh, found a piece of aluminum right here. And what it is is actually it's a license plate. Um, the great state of Idaho uh, decides that uh, you need to replace your uh, plates every so often, about every seven years. So we got a few of these lying around and uh, so I think this is going to be the trick. I've cut it down to about a half inch wide. Uh, it was almost four inches, three and three quarter inches long. And then I just marked out center and then went uh, an eighth of an inch off of center for the um, first hole. And then I've got a second hole about three eighths of an inch um, and from the outside edge. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and position this, drill some holes, and then I'm going to put some eighth inch rivets with an eighth inch uh, grab on. So I'll put four of those in place, and that should be enough to get this straight again to where you know I'll be happy uh, without having to uh, replace the whole door. Now I did contact the manufacturer of the door, which is uh, LCI. Uh, they did give me the proper part number and did uh, also give me a price for it, which is not too awful out of the park for replacing the whole door. But at the same time, I do have some graphics here that uh, would be uh, lost. Um, not much, but there is some graphics there. And if I could do it this way, um, I've got nothing into it. So let me get this thing set up and we'll get this repair done and see how well we do. So now I've already got my uh, eighth inch bit in my drill. You can see I got my third hand here. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and set this in place where I need it to be. And I'm going to go ahead and attach one side, uh, both rivets on one side, and then I will uh, flex the other side into position and then drill it. So center uh, between the two center holes. <laughs> Now I'm going to go ahead and put this on, get the rivet in place, and then uh, do my next one. Okay, so we've gotten it straightened up, as you can see, when it closes, it looks a whole lot better. Let me uh, go ahead and lock it. Now if you hadn't noticed, I've got locks on both of them, a little extra security. I'm thinking possibly in the future that I might be using the old thumb lock that was on right here. That way I can just uh, have it closed uh, when we're out camping if I don't want to lock them all the time. But this way, just a little extra security. Now, as you can see, it is a whole lot straighter. Looks like uh, the frame itself is sucked in a little bit over here. Um, but 
that compartment door is now almost completely stri straight. Get this unlocked. See, yeah. There's just a little bit of a bow to it. Now that I can live with. All right, now, so after uh, shutting the camera off, I kind of looked at it a little bit more and I kind of thought I can do a little bit better on this uh, repair. It still had a little bit of a bow to it, not too much. So what I did was I went ahead and added two extra holes to the um, brace and then put rivets in there. Now what I did when I uh, did that to drill it is I actually used my third hand here, kind of got underneath this and I flexed it over straight so it had a slight bow in and then made my holes and then when I put the rivets in it's actually putting a little extra tension right there and it looks a whole lot straighter looks a lot better so anyways if this helped you uh, fix your door please hit the like button subscribe and share and until the next one happy camping